Hello, everyone. Welcome back. My name is Tony Lau, and I'm a Feng Shui consultant. Today, we're going to be continue talking about the 12 zodiac sign. We are at dragon. How do you know you're a dragon? A lot of people want to be a dragon, but you really got to count on the year that you were born. If you were born after February 3rd, on any of these five year, you are potentially a dragon. 1928, 1940, 1952, 1964, 1976, 1988, and the year 2000, and also year 2012. So every 12 year, I would say congratulations is in order because you are number one this year in terms of wealth. The luck in general is better than all other 11 zodiac sign. The hidden wealth luck uh, helps continue accumulating wealth beyond your regular job. Even though like it's a, a tai shu year for you, is we call it the, the breaking tai shu, where you're not your year, but like indirectly you get affected by tai shu, they're usually free sign that affected by tai shu every year besides the sign that's committing tai shu but in terms of wealth it's a very good year for you especially good for unstable income type of job or such as like commission base where you don't get, get a fixed salary such as you work in the insurance industry or work in sales work in real estate work in other type of like business where you don't get a fixed paycheck. Why is it not helpful for you guys that work salary job? Because it's very unlikely that you suddenly get a massive raise from your boss. You might get a bonus here and there, but it's not helpful for that area of wealth, but more like accumulating. In terms of relationship, Dragon is number nine, mostly impact by Tai Shu. Like it's never good for a relationship when you hit the Tai Shu year. But Tai Shu really have nothing to do with wealth. If you have bad wealth and bad relationships that year because of just bad luck, like you have the Tai Shu and then you got other bad stars following you. But that's not the case with Dragon this year. Human relationship is a contributing factor for any type of like professional career. If others don't like you, the chance of your success will be impacted, especially this year. You might work super hard, just but just get, end up getting a little bit of gain. The lucky star you have this year, including the lunar star, which mean a uh, female benefactor. So if your boss or teammate or subordinate is female, there will be great support for your cause. For the negative star, there's a, there's a lot to cover six of them, namely the sheep play, the intervention, declining, coil, reaper, and urgent. Sheep play is the most serious one. It contributes to negative emotion. If we have lack of patience. It might get angry easier this year. And I think that follow along with the Tai Shu too. Like, so bad relationship and bad emotion. It's not a good combination overall. The other star that I'm too bad are like intervention, declining, coil, and like Reaper sounds bad, but it's really not. It's a minor star, urgent. All of these are neglectable. You have the lunar star that overcomes some of these negativity. And the general luck is de decided by the time you're born. Obviously as we covered before, like summer is number one. Spring is number two, autumn number three, winter is fourth, summer are, are those that are born between May 6, August 8. So spring would be like March 6 to May 6. Autumn would be August 8 to November 7. And winter would be November 7 to March 6. If you're working class or you work a job, get a paycheck, stay put this year, your dragon even though like you're number one in terms of wealth 
try to not change a job, particularly, especially if you are a autumn or winter born. Better wait until like March of 2022 if you can. Summer born, just summer, winter folks, try any opportunity present to you. If there's a job opportunity, go for it. Just not for those that are born in the autumn or winter time. That covers the dragon. And if you make it this far, consider subscribing. Hit the like button if you like this video. If you didn't come from the Facebook page, consider checking it out. There's links down below and I'll see you next time.